Welcome back, my loyal, wonderful, dedicated, fantastic, loving viewers. We're playing Limbo. Oh, I just needed a little break. What is this? Looks like we have a magnetic field underneath us. You can tell by the telltale slots underneath. What is that? What is that? Some kind of... Hmm, we have no boxes anywhere of any kind that I can tell. Unless we're supposed to bring... Uh, what is this? Unless we were supposed to bring those boxes with us from the last video. Whoa! Was not expecting that one. Hmm. Can I... What, what does this do? And what do you do? What? Magnetic? Right? Oh, it lifted this one as well. Let's see if we can make it from here. Oh, we can. Okay, well that's reassuring. Watch, it falls. Smash. Kablash. Um. Was I supposed to bring the boxes from last time? I don't even know. I don't, I, I don't even. What did that do? What did that even do? What did you. What did. What do you even do? Stupid switch. Do you do anything? You were oh, okay. That's me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Switch. I didn't mean it. I'm sure you are great at whatever function you fulfill. I'm sure your switch parents would be very proud of you. Uh, <laughs> All right. Okay. I'm starting to see the basics of this. This one needs to be up so I can jump on it and use it to get to this ledge. But then this one needs to be down. That way I can jump on it to get to the next ledge. So let's see what this does. Maybe I'll do it in this order and it'll change something. Ta -da! Nothing. What is that? What are you, little string thing? Thing a ring? What are you? What are you? There's not even any. T There's not even any boxes I can use. Thing, thing up there. Let me go see if I can drag those boxes over. I don't even know. Did I once I jump down? Can I not get back? Ooh, that's harsh. That's harsh. That's harsh. Okay, boxes are a no-no. Whoa! Did you hear that little screech? A little zombie limbo chipmunk, uh, chipmunk friend. Whoa! Hey, why is it still up there? Why is it still up there? Why is it still up there? Why... Why is it still up there? Whoa! Hold on a tick. We turned it off. Is that a battery? I'm so confused. What did I do? Is this on? I thought I turned it off. Yeah, now it's on. What the hell? What the hell? What? Is it a battery? So if the ma if the magnet is off, gravity's on, everything's up there. Turn it off, it falls down. Let's try different combinations. Switch one is on, then switch two, then turn switch one off again, and they should fall. They don't. Figure it out. Concentrate. One of them needs to be up and one of them needs to be down. This one needs to be down and the one on the left needs to be up. I need some time to experiment. Alright, one thing that I'm noticing... I wonder if it's timed at all. Look at the little... It would be nice if they were timed. Because look, there's a convenient little gap right here that if that came down, I wouldn't die. I think... I, I figured it out. Well, I figured 
part of it out. This switch makes them go up into the air. This one holds them. Right? The light on top is uh, on. If I turn this on, it should stay on. Yes, I stay on. But I'm just wondering if there's something I need to do in that little cubby. Is it going to eventually... What is this little thing? It's rope. It's a nothing. Will it fall eventually? It falls too fast. There's no way that I could try to get on the ledge before it falls. It's just too fast. Hmm. Alright, guys. I've been... I've been stuck on this pause... Puzzle. I've been stuck on this puzzle for... I was going to say this part. For a while. I've just been... I've been... I, I understand the mechanisms at work. Basically, what we have here is this magnetizes the ceiling. So you have the uh, the, the grounding pole or, or the whatever. The, the line going to the ceiling the act that magnetizes the ceiling and it holds them up. All right, But they have to be on the ceiling clearly to be able to be held. So if I turn this off, which is basically the levitation or whatever, it's going to stay on there forever. Why does that thing keep jiggling? I wish it would stop doing that because it's distracting me. It's making me think that it's relevant. Relevant. Relevant, guys. It's making me think that this line here is relevant. And I really can't. I, I cannot. There has to be something. It cannot be this easy and I'm missing it. There's, there's, four, there's four factors at work. There's this block. There's the left block. There's the magnetic ceiling, and then there's the... Wait. And then there's the le levitation floor. I've, I've been stuck. I'm stuck. Little pebbles, are you trying to help me? Pebbles, tell me, tell me the truth. Be my guru. Can I just break these? Can I just use their massive force to just break it? Break. Dang it. Pebbles, pebbles, help me. Show me the way. Give me a sign. Give me a hint. Give me a something. I cannot reach these buttons from anywhere other than directly underneath them. So how am I supposed to manipulate them? Unless I manipulate these blocks from the floor below into the right states that they need to be. The states being this left block being up and the right block being down. How am I going to do that from on the floor? I've done every combination I can think of. It doesn't make sense. They're on the same they're on the same floor. What's the difference? Okay, just think of this logically. What's the difference between the right block and the left block? Well, this left block has an extra ledge. That's higher than this one on the right. So the one on the left... Ergo! The one on the left is going to hit the ground sooner than the other one. The one on the left is going to reach the ground sooner than the one on the right. That's the that's the only difference between the two. And somehow, because of that difference, I should be able to exploit that and make the right one in a state of being down while the left one is up. I, I'm using every brain cell I have here. Okay. I, I cannot manipulate the buttons from anywhere. I cannot do anything not from here, nothing. So basically all of my actions should be done down here. The only thing I can do in raise is raise and lower them, so think. The only difference between the left and the right is that the one on the left has a shorter distance to travel because of this ledge here. It has to be with timing. It has to be with timing. I can't... I can't run from one to the other. It's gonna have to be... Huh. Give me some more time. I am not going to look this up. I'm tempted. I'm sorely, sorely tempted to look this up. But I don't want to. I'm gonna 
I'm gonna figure this out or I'm just gonna go to bed and sleep on it. All right, so because I can't think of anything that I can actually do, I'm trying to think of some kind of circumstance that would allow me to use, you know, bending space and time, all right? We're gonna bend space and time for this instance and try to figure out how we can make the left block up and the right one down. All right, so, so if I hit the switch on the left, the switch, this block is going to reach the ceiling first. So I would basically have to do, bam, reaches the ceiling, turn it off, because there's a delay. So what would have to happen in about the time of half a second or a second is I would have to hit this switch the moment that this left block touches the ceiling, hit this switch to make it stay, but before the right block hits the ceiling, hit this again to make it go back down. Thereby... <gasps> I was just explaining it in my head. I was breaking the bonds of time and space. Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god! I am so awesome! I am so pumped. I... I'm not even that good at puzzle games, but I, I can't. I just, you know, you break it down. I don't know how I did that, guys. I, I came up with the theory in my head, but then I never thought that I would be able to go through that sequence in time. Ah, oh, screw it. I'm past it. Hallelujah! Thank you, Reverend Sheep. We are forever in your debt for your guidance and your wisdom. What the hell? What is this? What are you? Woo! Oh, God! Falling to my... Whoa! I'm falling up. Falling up. Oh, please tell me it saved it. Please, please, please save it. Did you save it? Did it save? Please. Oh, thank goodness. All right, guys. Well, I don't know. Hey, it's raining again. I don't know if this is taking too much time, but I'm going to cut it off here. This may be the end of the video, or I may see you momentarily. We'll find out.